For decades, the computer operating system has remained largely the same structure wrapped in new colors, but reports suggest that Microsoft is preparing to break this cycle with what could be the most significant shift in its history. The leaks surrounding the next version of Windows, often referred to by the internal code name, Next Valley, point to a future that is not just about a fresh coat of paint. Instead, the company appears to be rebuilding the foundation of the platform entirely. This is not simply an update, it is a fundamental reimagining of how a computer should work in the modern world. The most substantial change discussed in recent reports is a new architecture called Core PC. To understand why this is important, one must look at how Windows currently functions. Right now, the operating system is like a massive single block where user files, applications, and critical system data all live together. This structure, while familiar, makes the system prone to errors. If one small part breaks or a bad update occurs, the entire structure can become unstable. Core PC aims to change this by separating the operating system into different sections. Imagine the computer's brain is placed in a locked box that the user cannot touch or accidentally break. This is called state separation. In this new design, the core files that make the computer run are kept apart from the files the user creates and the applications they install. This approach is similar to how mobile devices function today. By locking away the most important parts of the system, the software becomes much harder to break. If a virus tries to attack or a user deletes the wrong file, the core system remains safe and untouched in its own protected space. This separation also brings a major benefit to how updates happen. Currently, updating a computer can be a slow and frustrating process that forces the user to stop working and wait. With the proposed core PC structure, updates could happen in the background on a separate section of the drive. When the user restarts the machine, the computer simply switches to the newly updated section instantly. This would make the long waiting times for configuring updates a thing of the past. It promises a smoother, faster experience that respects the user's time. Beyond the hidden structure, the visual experience is also expected to undergo a dramatic transformation. Leaked design concepts have shown a desktop that looks quite different from what users are accustomed to. The most striking difference is the floating taskbar. For years, the bar at the bottom of the screen has been glued to the edge. In the new designs, this bar floats slightly above the bottom of the screen, with rounded corners. It looks less like a tool for a heavy machine, and more like a dock found on a tablet or a smart device. This visual change suggests that Microsoft is trying to make the software work better for touchscreens, without losing the power needed for a mouse and keyboard. Another major change seen in these concepts is the movement of system information. The clock, battery status, and Wi-Fi signals might move from the bottom corner to a totally new bar at the very top of the screen. This would leave the bottom area clean, focusing only on the applications the user is currently using. It is a cleaner, more organized look that reduces clutter and helps the user focus on their work. However, the visual changes are only the surface level of the story. The true power of the next Windows version lies in its integration of artificial intelligence. While current versions have added AI assistance as separate applications, the next version is expected to weave this intelligence directly into the nervous system of the computer. This concept, often called AI first, means the computer will not just wait for commands, it will try to anticipate what the user needs. Reports indicate that this new intelligence will be able to read and understand the context of what is on the screen. For example, if a user is looking at an email about a meeting, the system might automatically suggest opening the calendar or finding the relevant documents without being asked. This is a level of assistance that goes far beyond a simple search bar. It turns the operating system into an active partner that helps manage the workload. This feature is heavily tied to a tool known as Copilot, which is expected to be present in every part of the experience, from changing settings to organizing files. To make this level of intelligence possible, the hardware requirements for computers are likely to rise significantly. This is where the transition might become difficult for some enthusiasts. To process all this information quickly and privately, the computer needs a special piece of hardware called a Neural Processing Unit, or NPU. This acts like a second brain dedicated entirely to thinking tasks, separate from the main processor that runs normal programs. 
Leaks suggest that many of the advanced AI features will not work on older computers that lack this specific chip. This could create a divide in the market. Users with modern powerful machines will get the full smart experience, while those on older hardware might see a simpler version of the operating system. There are also rumors that the amount of memory, or RAM, required to run the system smoothly will increase. While four gigabytes was once enough, the new standard for an AI-powered experience could be 16 gigabytes or even more. This ensures the computer can think and react without slowing down. However, for those who still need those older applications, the company is working on a solution. The new system could run those old programs in a virtual layer, which is like a simulation within the main system. This keeps the main operating system modern and fast, while still allowing the user to run necessary vintage software if they absolutely must. It offers the best of both worlds. The speed of a modern device with the compatibility that professionals rely on. The question of when this major change will arrive remains a topic of intense debate. Early rumors pointed to a release in 2024, but recent information suggests a delay. Microsoft seems to be focusing on refreshing the current Windows 11 platform with new features first. This has led many experts to believe that the true next generation might not arrive until late 2025, or perhaps even later. The company is taking its time to ensure that such a massive structural change is done correctly. Security remains a top priority in this new vision. The separation of the system files in Core PC makes it much harder for malicious software to hide deep inside the computer. In the current model, if a virus gets root access, it can control everything. In the new model, even if a virus gets onto the machine, it cannot easily cross the barrier into the locked system partition. This read-only design means the core files cannot be changed by anyone, not even the user, which drastically reduces the risk of a total system failure. Of course, with any unreleased product, plans can change. Features that are currently being tested might be cut before the final release, and dates can shift. But the direction is clear. The era of the static, monolithic operating system is ending. The future is modular, intelligent, and secure. Whether this next version is called Windows 12 or something entirely different, it is shaping up to be a defining moment for personal computing. Enthusiasts and casual users alike will find themselves adapting to a new way of interacting with their digital world, one where the computer is less of a tool and more of a partner. This evolution is necessary. As mobile phones have become the primary device for many, the PC has needed to evolve to justify its place. By adopting the strengths of mobile platforms, security, seamless updates, and instant-on capability, and combining them with the raw power and flexibility of a PC, Microsoft is aiming to secure the relevance of the desktop for the next decade. The leaked details paint a picture of a bold future, one that carries risks but offers the reward of a truly modern computing experience. The next valley is not just a destination, it is a signal that the computer as we know it is about to change forever.